open up the playpen. Ha 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 ha! We took out the baby maker and opened up the playpen. Yeah. Winnie! <laughs> <laughs> Hey kids, one beautiful mom over there. She looks really young. She might even be the mom. She might be the mom's other child. Beautiful lady though, beautiful girl. So here's what we're looking. Back to him. I didn't do anything to him. I know, but the language. Anytime, boy. Anytime. 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 Hey, it takes a bigger man to walk away. He's got his camera off. It's a bigger man to walk away. Kyle, kind of weird you want to fuck a 25 year old. What's your mouth? Come the fuck on, motherfucker! Sir, go on, please. Please, Dad, come on, let's go. I'm not going anywhere. Come on, Dad, come on. You come to my show? You run your goddamn cocksucker? Yeah, you, motherfucker! Please, Dad. Come on, Dad. There's been dead heat. Come on, Dad. 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 We've had somebody take parts off of it since it's been sitting there. Oh, yeah, uh, they better be watching it. I catch anybody out here, I'm gonna shoot them. He just bought a grill, and I, I think the grill. <laughs> I couldn't stand the stink in there if I went in his lob or his apartment, you know what I mean? Them guys are nasty, you know that, right? And black people don't take a bath. Oh my god. They got these they get these what they call ring worms in their head. Oh my god. And the talk about lice. Oh my god. And the women are just as bad. Oh god no. I was like, who to? Oh. They stink that bad. Oh. And their clothes are probably all just ugh, you know? Oh. Yeah, I had one of them. Found some fun with some kids over here. I wonder if they're still there or not. I had to warp. Some kids over here with some planes. No, I they're still there. Rolling joints, so I can't see. Howdy, folks. How's everybody's uh, Saturday night going? Well, technically, it's, it's Sunday night. But how's your. Oh. How's your guys' nights going? Hey, Barry, how, how was your day today? Well, that's something funny. Motherfucker's house is collapsing on itself, and he goes and buys a lawnmower because he, he's too dumb and stupid to fix his old ones. That's why I say that's how... Listen, that's, and I said it in a video a couple of years back. He probably got the majority of them cars. He got them and drove them. And once something breaks on them, he parks them and buys another one. It's like his lawnmowers. And now after I said that, what's he do? He goes and buys another lawnmower. You don't want to sharpen the blades or fix the deck or whatever the fuck's wrong with it. John Deere now. But I'm talking about buying a monster for it, folks. A monster for it. But I like doing these pumpkin run videos. Kind of hope Barry keeps those these up. I mean, he didn't mention us though, so uh, maybe he mentions maybe his he, haters. 
Maybe he knows. Yeah, but that's fine. You can mix your haters all you want. I mean, keep my fu- our names out of your fucking mouth and move on with your life. Like or a good boy. You're sorrier than you are now. But, so I kind of hope Barry keeps these up. Like this year, I kind of hope he puts one out because these are just awesome. And uh, I like I like reviewing them. Which, there'll be ones from us, you know, down there. I don't know if Barry's going to do one down there or not this year. But, we like reviewing them. And I'm going to do a live stream down there. I think I'm going to do some stuff for the main channel down there. Yeah, so, yeah. Bus, folks. Check out the school bus. Hey, Barry, bring back mirrors. <laughs> hey, Barry. That's what... That's for me, Barry. Hey, Barry, that's what a restored Cadillac looks like. Beamer and Sun Garage here. Check out this 1964 beautiful Cadillac here. Look at this convertible. Careful, Ryan, man. You guys can't have that. It would have a tarp on the fucking Sweet. for the convertible top. And it would have rattle can spots everywhere Listen on it. To me. Do you think Ryan would have probably bought that shit very much? Like, yeah, I can put it on, bud. Get the shit. I'll put it on for you. What yeah, you I mean, I, mean, I would at least want you to said, attempt it. He said Ryan even bought the tools. Yeah. I mean, I would at least want you to attempt it. I don't know what tools. I mean, I know you got to have a staple gun. I mean, but what? A roller, maybe? I mean, I don't know. But that's the thing. I would at least want you to attempt it. I spent the money. We need. I want to well, at least yeah, attempt I've it. I've seen it done before. I mean, he's worked, he came miles. He's worked miles harder for it. Oh, man, that's what he did. It was down you, know, what, you know what I would love to see him do, Barry? Now, like I, I said, I've never done so a purple top myself. The Corvette rear ends. The Corvette rear ends right? making that pop noise, right? Beautiful. I would love for him to try to diagnose that. He wouldn't know where to fucking start. He looked around and go, wow, what's this on a spaceship? <laughs> Sweet. Yeah. This one looks nice too. I use the term rear end on a Corvette lightly because it's not really a rear end, it's all independent. That's the only part that, otherwise you got drive shafts and everything else. Well, half shafts, same fucking principle. Well, that's all I can say about career and you looked at me like you were just tasted ass. <laughs> I'm tasting berries. Got a Willie's. Lots of Willie's. Lots of Willie's down there. But it's kind of funny. You go missing for three days and that's the best content you put out. It's showing more of, look what I got, look what I got. That's what I mean. He don't fix his old shit. He just goes and replaces it. Buys new. I mean, now your house needs a your house needs fixed up. Fuck your house. Like genius. I mean, yeah. You got to. That's why. That's what's so comical. He's talking about buying a monster for that crap and more. I mean, what the fuck do you need a monster for? And who goes in my country? First of all, second of all, where are you gonna put the grass when you're backing up and shit? I mean, and who the fuck goes in my he, he supposedly got this, why didn't you go buy a Husqvarna with a big deck? How about you cut your grass every week like you're supposed to and you don't eat a bunch of shit? I mean, every every fucking bed, I mean. You know what I mean? Like a Husqvarna like you got out back. Why not go buy one of them? What, too expensive? Go buy you a bad boy zero turn like Jacob's got. Well, that's the thing. I mean, he said he paid $13 for that crap more. Yeah, at Blue Books for, at Blue Books for $1,800. But he paid 13 for it. Like, wow, you got off such a good deal there, Barry. Yeah. So we what was the, look at I mean, listen, guys, no more is maybe cut grass than like a foot tall pond. You know, it's hard on You know he don't pick up in his yard. You see his yard, so you know his yard's running over bricks, fucking chunks of wood, kittens, puppies, goldfish. Looking at Barry makes me want to kick Our a puppy in the face. You know where the rich is, fucking all kinds of shit. Chunks of brick. I mean, I probably said brick, but when he's cutting grass in his yard, man, you know, somebody have a flashback. They think more still going on. There's fucking chunks of shit, black landmines going on. I just thought something, dude. You know what bugs me? Hang on, on a serious note about Ryan. He's got that wallet chain, right? And he's walking up close to people's car with that wallet chain swinging. Yeah, which is pretty much just a horse and stuff and laid in the seat. Like, did your dad not teach you how to walk up to somebody? Like, that wallet chain needs to be tucked away. That could scratch paint, buddy, pal, friend. Don't want to be scratching people's paint. And some of the cars, you tell they actually love their cars, unlike fucking your dad. Oh, yeah. 
I think Ryan loves his cars. I think even Barry loves his cars, but yes, so is. <laughs> he loves them to death, you know what I mean? He's obsessed with his cars. He don't love them, he's obsessed with them. He still didn't mention when he did that old Omega Porter pattern. I mean, Still hasn't mentioned Mr. Wilson yet. Thought he was going to go back to work for him. Right. What happened, Barry? He didn't like your ass with baby killer? He didn't want to put your fat, nasty ass on one of his new trucks? Four ain't being your fucking year, bud. It's just getting worse. It's just getting started. It's not even halfway over yet. 440, Barry. Once I hit that 500, oh, I can't wait to do a video. Because then I'm gonna make you eat your fucking words more than you eat everything else I shove down your throat. Remember? And once again, no, nobody here ever said you couldn't build, put a, a ton of lawnmower trailer, Barry. He was, looking, do it. he was he was looking. He was looking. He was looking for kids to do it. Kids to do it. Yes. He was searching online, looking for videos on how to do it, and if they sold a kit to do it. I'm not fucking with you. In the video, next video, you'll see. But you're a, you're a fabricator. You're, you're a, you can do anything. Oh my God. I mean, and you did put it on, but you put it on crooked. It tongue's crooked. I mean, but it's okay. It's a long one, so it don't have to be straight. I mean, Hell, sir. Like... Hey guys, what's something that Cadillac and the green pile of shit they drive every day not have in common? That one's got shiny paint and it looks restored. Something that one will ever be. Triple A to drive it. <laughs> uh, hey Barry, you a platinum member yet? <laughs> hey Barry, what's in your wallet? I'm not one of the uh, uh, fucking, uh, what's his name? Uh, that's a joke, that's a man. He's got a uh, Yeah, I know. Jamie Phillips. Actually, thought of parts. Yeah, he's got a Ford. He did a video showing how to change a battery on one of Corvettes. Yeah, it's a, it's one like, exactly like my C4, and it's a nightmare. Good. And I comment, he goes, he goes, I wondered, he goes, if you had changed yours yet. I was like, no, I said, I hope I don't. Because you got to take that panel. Okay. Off the side, you got to pull that out of the way and a bunch of other stupid shit. And I'm like, they could have made it so much more simpler. Now, the ones before that went behind the seat. I'm yep. sure you know, And one of them little compartments that'd be behind the seat. Because your battery would set. So it was C3. Yeah. 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 Oh, and one of the ones we're going to do here next. Barry's own friends don't want to be on fucking camera with him. And I got proof. How fucking Jacobs he been on K? He's been in a couple yeah, videos. It's a big difference between being your neighbor and being neighborly and being your friend. Barry doesn't know what a friend he's getting into a friend with. You meet somebody one time and think they're fucking best buddies for life. Hey kid, you better get the fucking, you better hope your dad ain't near you. He can't be by one of them. It's just more proof than getting how much friends he's getting on us. Who the fuck would want to be his friend? Like, let's even talk about it. Barry knows no loyalty. Barry's the type of dude in his younger years try to hail your old lady, try to fuck her. Like, like that's not the type of people you need to keep around you. I will sit by myself before I hang with a dude that's going to be trying to fuck my old lady. Or try to stab me in the back, for try to out me for whatever they, they think they got on me. You tell Barry your deepest, darkest fucking secrets and Barry gonna play session live running his mouth about it. Hey Barry, your base Skylar study hoods like that? That's right, you got fucking what three, but they're just base Skylarks, nothing special. Same with your mock nun, it's nothing special. And it's fucking roach. It's the worst one in fucking Ohio. Fuck it's the worst one between Ohio and Indiana. Listen, I'm sure it's the worst mock one out there, but people's not trying to say they're all this and that and this and that. That's what makes Barry the worst of the worst. I mean, he makes it sound like it's a daily driver. You drive that son of a bitch. Hey, Barry, that's Christine. The real Christine. Aw. Uh, he is such a dork, dude. I mean,
they're gonna copyright and check my car, so I'm gonna call it. Uh, Oh, I know you're talking about Kelly or name. Uh, what's it called? Uh, forget the other, but anyway, if you couldn't make a replica of a movie car, people wouldn't do the general. Either. Think about it. I mean, Eleanor. Eleanor is. Eleanor is six seconds. I can't call it Eleanor because it's because. He's it's fucking retarded. Like, 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 Stupid or pretty shit. much 12 o'clock today. Right now, pretty much. So, not all the cars are here, but they're getting there. So, luckily, there's still a few spots. You guys won't see <clears throat> that kind of quality Those fucking classic ready. car, that truck right there. Pretty Something in that ready. kind of shape at the Beamer well, Sons of Garage compound. If you're not going to find the videos, we're very talking about this. Yeah, it was right at it, its own PlayStation Live, so one of his lives, it was right after he, at, he mouthed off to that chick for just doing her job because Barry's a fat, lazy fuck, and then wanna have to walk through the event because he's fat and lazy. I mean, called her all kinds of names, like, dude, you're a piece of shit. Well, I mean, I, I just. Before the memory runs up on the phone. You have every right, Barry, to have the te what teeth are left in your head knocked out of your head for the shit you've done on here. Nobody could fault anybody, and I'm not saying somebody do this. But if one of these people in this town fucking saw you out at a gas station and they cleaned your clock, ain't nobody on here could say it wasn't fucking deserved. I kind of like to park the swap now. It's like my favorite You have to that little girl deserved. Just that alone. Somebody should take your fucking head and see one of them car doors, put it inside and shut your fucking head in repeatedly. He's sticking metaphors. You don't need somebody to actually do it, man. I think it's alright. Exactly. Not saying somebody go do it. I'm just saying. People like Barry, horrible people, do not deserve to breathe. They should be fucking drawn and quartered. Check out the louvers in that man. Wow. And what's sad is he didn't even, he wants to talk about people's parents. I tell you what, dude, at least my father raised me. And my parents may not have been the best fucking parents in the world, but at least they fucking raised me, you pedophile. At least my grandparents were there for me. You know something that my parents and grandparents will have that you won't bury on their last days on this planet? Family around. While you're sitting there in your own fucking feces, surrounded by 86 piles of fucking junk, looking into that abyss you call fucking the darkness that surrounds you, with Ryan looking back at you, you won't have them 86 grandkids looking around you, you won't have family surrounding you, you'll die alone. And that's just in of itself. Sitting in your fucking lift chair, withering away, old man. While, while your brother and everybody else on their last day will have family surrounding them, you won't. The only person that fucking gives a flying fuck about you, you keep fucking over. You had tanked his YouTube career, then you've done other shit that's coming his way that I feel sorry for him. Because without you burying his life, the kids probably used to deal with consequences for Barry's actions. You got him. You couldn't be with Barry for 40 fucking years and not be using Without Barry in his life, he would be a, it would be so much better for him. Without the drain of Barry fucking S. Beamer drowning him every fucking day to where the kid probably don't want to even get up and go to work. Because you're a fucking lazy, fat, lowlife piece of shit.
can't stand somebody that, oh, I raised my kid. No, you fucking didn't. Taking that away from your grand, your fucking parents. They, they manned up and raised Ryan. While you were doing dope and doing stupid shit because you're a fucking retard. All right, the police are cars. Mm -hmm. Put nothing with lies at risk because you're an idiot. That's okay, though. When they caught you, they, they gave it what they had. At least my parents raised me. At least my dad, in all of his flaws and his habits, made sure he stuck around for me, Barry. He didn't choose alcohol or drugs over me like you did Ryan, buddy. Because you're a weak-ass human being. Y'all got your mock one there? Never mind of them windy ass back roads, man. Your frame probably was shot out of it. Well, son, we ran into a guardrail and I wasn't even drinking. I was drinking Mountain Dew. Hey, get out of his way. Don't you know it's Beamer and Sons Garage coming through? Hey, Barry, got one of those? Hey, Barry, I wonder how much angle iron's fucking on that car right there. Oh, that's a V8 car. Never mind, yours is a six cylinder. Hey, hey, Barry, do y'all got a Spencer's near you? I hear they got an Insta spouse. All you gotta do is blow her up and watch her go. <laughs> so you think that you'll ever see the fastback or the mock one looking like a blue car? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I had to make a joke. Yeah. <laughs> we don't point, we don't point out the fucking rust holes. Barry's gonna do a video this week with bed frame zapping. Oh yeah. Garage. We already have like a 65 Cuda, which is pretty sweet. You don't see about the fucking level of the fender truck. That is cool. <laughs> Talk about jack up the corner, son. It's not level. You gotta jack up some more. <laughs> sweet. <laughs> gotta go to Menard to get him a laser level. <laughs> I'll prove them motherfuckers wrong. <laughs> you shit. Sixty-six charger. Check that out. Unlike yours, that has solid frame rails. <laughs> no, I 
one of the videos. Oh, shit. I'm going to switch. I said Connor. Okay. Let's see. 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 That's all That's all called, all Listen, crazy. Barry says that he is a Mopar basically god, right? This is comedy. There's a video on here where he couldn't tell the difference between a 69 Charger and a 70. You wonder what the big, the big oh, black goodness. small block can take. I mean, fucking Ray Charles could tell the difference. <laughs> fucking dude, such a fucking idiot. Damn, Barry, you did some awesome body work. <laughs> oh, wait, that's somebody else's car. That explains it. When he's done, you're going to put a magnet on the fucking thing. going to fall off. <laughs> you get your speaker. Well, <laughs> you can even... Don't start back the way. Stick that, pick it up, drop in the pressure. <laughs> You gonna walk up there that screen door, start cutting out little patch panels, putting in their newspaper. I think that's a '69 right there. I could be wrong. Again, not an expert. I don't really care for that body style. I think they're overpriced and all that, but. They do look, they are good looking cars. Don't just take Barry and buy a car by Get a job. Save your money. There's a 70 right there. Yeah, but that's one car that ordinary, you could, you could save up and save up. And the, the ordinary, the average guy will never go afford one of them. Tell. Did he just touch? The, he just touched this man's car. Yeah. I had at home. I have a '66. Yeah, and the frame rails are fucked. Yeah, on. I have '67 Yeah. He ain't gonna drive it. Y'all don't have to worry about that. Around the field of broken dreams. I always think it's interesting how they have like the special luminescent uh, gauges on the inside. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, it's, got a, it's got a weird looking uh, transformer too. Transformer, but the transformer goes bad and doesn't want to work. Barry's in like disguise. It, <laughs> it work. Right now, my, 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 my life saving one exactly because I thought like it was supposed to. Yeah. Optimus <laughs> Barry. <laughs> See, it's got the AC going on. Oh shit. Oh yeah. And then you got the after. See the Mach 1 roll up and all of a sudden it transforms into a giant berry with like crooked legs walking towards you. That keeps it nice and cool there. Yeah. 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 I like that you went with like the Mopar performance. Uh, Falcon. That looks really nice. <laughs> Every time he goes, mm, I can nice. literally drink a beer. Uh, I got one, like I said, I'm still, I'm building on it, I'm working on it. But there's, <laughs> there's just so many things that you gotta fix on it. Oh, gosh. Right, you're fucking awesome, dude. They've been built up for 10 years and you can't tell. <laughs> hey, it has lost more, it's got more weight reduction now than when it started on it. That's all I'm going to be working on today, that's it. That's his drag car. <laughs> the rush is working, you know how you know when he works on the car, when, you, when he's done, the rush is working on the car. That's why they don't let Barry park his shit anywhere here, because they got all gonna have their tennis shots to walk up on. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> That's a, I think it's a 70 Roadrunner. I think. Has their gravel like we got it. It's got a Hemi. Hey Barry, there's your Hemi. <laughs> 
<laughs> That's a badass car. Show me the tell lights. I'll tell you if it's a 70 or not. Buddy, I guarantee you everything on that car works. Look at it. That's a labor of love. Yep, 70. Ooh. Well, there's. Hey, but, hey Barry. Check Fuck, you got a 340 duster sitting there. Oh, wait, never mind. Yours is a 74 and it's a 318 three speed. Yeah, he's got his done up. But you said it was a 340, but. Got the shark tooth grill going on too, yeah. Anyways, we're almost time with this out of time with this video. Aww. So please remember to like, share, subscribe, uh, remember to click that bell, that bell button, and subscribe to Jerry Phillips Action Auto Parts and Scott Speed Shop. Now folks, I don't know if y'all can see it. Look in that row. How many of them do you see that look like Barry Beamer or any of his 86 collection sitting there? You know, I'm surprised Parker Ryan didn't invite him down to like have his own exhibit out of 85 cars. Cause I'm sure nobody's got 85 show cars that he could have his own car show with. The cards you see him with Barry Beamer. Right. Right. <laughs> oh, shit. The late great Barry Beamer. <laughs> One pump jump coming at you. <laughs> Alright, you Alright, we're going to the next one. Fuck you, Barry. Leave them kids alone.